Bohr's Atomic Theory Objective To learn the atomic theory proposed by Bohr. In 1913, Niels Bohr, a Danish scientist, proposed a model of the atom which was based on the Rutherford theory. Rutherford's theory had shown the atom consisted of a positively charged nucleus with negatively charged electrons orbiting it. Let's look more closely at the postulates of Bohr's atomic theory. According to the Bohr model, the electrons of an atom will move in circular orbits around the nucleus in much the way the planets orbit the sun. The orbits are fixed and referred to as stationary, having electrons that orbit without radiating any energy. Bohr described these orbits of different energy as energy levels or shells. He also described an electron's energy as quantized, meaning the electrons can be either one energy level or another, but not in between. The energy level in which an electron normally orbits is said to be its ground state. An electron can move to a higher level through the absorption of energy. Electrons which have moved to a higher energy level will be less stable and in an excited state. An excited electron will release the energy it has absorbed as it returns to its original ground state. The energy released by electrons will be in the range of wavelengths of energy detectable by humans in visible light. Bohr postulated that when electrons are closer to the nucleus, they require less energy than those orbiting from farther away. As a means of differentiating between the energy levels, Bohr numbered them. Energy level 1 will be closest to the nucleus and the larger the number of the energy level gets, the farther away the electron will be from the nucleus. Bohr also postulated that the number of electrons found in particular energy levels will differ. Energy level 1 can hold up to 2 electrons, while energy level 2 can hold as many as 8 electrons. Summary According to the Bohr's theory, the electrons in an atom will move in stationary, circular orbits known as shells or energy levels. An electron can move to a higher energy level by absorbing energy. As an excited electron returns to its original ground state, it will release the energy it has absorbed. Energy level 1 will be closest to the nucleus, while energy level with higher numbers will be farther away from the nucleus.